everyone and welcome back to the channel. So it's our first outing of 2024 and we're going to do a pub stop. Um, first thing just to get used to everything again and make sure everything's working, the heating, the water, gas etc and another short outing for Tinkerbella to get her back into the swing of things as well. She's uh, a bit meowy at the moment, she doesn't like the travelling. Um, so we um, like I say, we're going to do a pub stop and it's um, quite a famous, well, well, I don't know if it's famous. It's really. just really, really it's, old. It's, the, it's supposed to be the oldest pub in England, UK? England. England. Apparently it's a little bit contentious. Um, yeah. Not contentious. Con contentious. That there's somebody and there's another pub that... One of the oldest yeah. then, shall we say. But it's so, over a thousand year old. Yeah. So hopefully... Um, We'll show you around there, but first we're going to probably take a walk around the area as well. So stay tuned and see what we can find. Very slow to park now, we've just got in there. Yeah, we're in the far corner. So we've um, decided to go for a walk before we go back to the pub. We booked in for um, an evening meal tonight. They said that there's a possibility that we might get a, a knock on the door. There is a caravan site not that far away. And um, apparently they just come down to let everybody know that the... No, I think it's owner. But they, they actually turn around and say, you know, it's, oh, it's a private place and you shouldn't really be parking there in the car park. But we've, um, we have permission from the pub and they said it's absolutely fine. So, um, yeah, booked in for evening meal. Quite for a bit of a walk, there's a, a wood just at the end of the, the road, so if you want to take a walk down there, it um, seems to be quite a nice quite a nice walk. We'll catch up with you later. So it's the um, last week in January. Um, there's definitely lots and lots of signs of um, spring starting. Uh, snowdrops, there's definitely bluebells starting to push through. Uh, and lots and lots of daffodils so um, it's not too far away guys we'll be back out in the warmth <laughs> sunshine being here to sit outside as vans and and not be needing a fire not shivering <laughs> yeah fingers crossed so let us know what your um, potentially what your plans are for this season um, we've got a couple, well we've definitely got one festival booked in already haven't we? Yeah. Which is Van Love Fest, we're going to be there. Um, we're going to the first Warner show which um, is at Harrogate and we only go for a day. If we go there we don't do the NEC but if we do the NEC we don't go there. Oh sure. Yeah, yeah so um, it'd be nice to try and get to 
at least one of the Warner shows for the weekend this year. We keep on saying we're going to do it, um, usually it's season finale, because um, it's the, the closest one to us. Um, but yeah, let us know what your um, your plans are this year, and it um, be nice to hear from you all. Better keep seeing where I'm going, I'll only end up being on my ass. Waterfall? <laughs> really seen that because I didn't film it but Dawn's just proper cut me up walked straight across in front of me and then laughed about it laughed rude so I've just come out of the woods now and heading back into the village and we've come across the uh, village library so obviously take one and put one back in the old that guy telephone Catherine Cook. I don't think it is. There was a guy that we watched on um, YouTube yesterday. What's he called? Um, idiot. Vid in, village idiot. Idiot. Village idiot. And he does a lot of villages and he put a book in here and he wanted it to go quite a long way around a lot of country. And it's definitely not here anymore, so. What you had to do was um, sign it and pass it on, take it to a different village and carry on like that. We're just coming to the village church called All Hallows and it's got some, um, is it war graves? It's got war graves, war here, graves but, um, around as well. Also pretty ancient as well. Yeah, so we'll have a, just have a quick look around. So you've just got um, a little seating area, picnic area, really nice if you want to come and reflect, think about your loved ones. So as you can see we're in there. We've just had a, had a quick look at some graves, we won't show you but because they were one of the old ones, what, 1759, so it just shows you how old they are. Well looking um, on the internet it says the church was opened in 18, um, 18, 850 AD and wow. that it's one of the oldest um, surviving buildings in Yorkshire. So, um, yeah, yeah. Well, dated uh, back quite a way. Have a quick look inside. Pretty dark in here, I don't know if you'll be able to see much. It's, you can see how old it is. It's lovely. Still got the uh, Christmas scene up. Very nice, nice and quaint. It's nice to get married in here. <laughs> Memorial there for both wars who served us. And then there's a little, well, say a little, it's massive collage of the village. Take it done by the children. Well, this is the remaining part of the Motton Bailey Castle. Um, private property now so there's uh, definitely no going in there and um, yes yeah, something slightly different there you go yeah bun looks different it's um, pretzel and I've got steak and ale pie chips Yorkshire pudding and some really thick gravy. Yep, mash. So how's the meal been? 
Mm -hmm. What? Cheeseburger, you could taste the cheese. Yeah. Well, there weren't anything left on plate, let's put it that way. <laughs> In either of us. Blimey, that's awfully close. I can't zoom out anymore. So, yeah, we, um, we, we stuffed. <sighs> there's no there's no ifs or buts about it. We're both stuffed. No on coffees, no desserts. And um, I'm going to try and get a wonder out pub later on tomorrow, maybe dinner time ish, once they all reopen. And um, yeah, we'll let them have a proper look around. It's supposed yeah. to be spooky going on. It's supposed to be what? See, I think there's supposed to be spooky goings on. Oh, I'm being told it's definitely haunted. But I'm not going upstairs to have a look. <laughs> I don't blame her. Things like that. <laughs> right, we'll see you later. Morning everyone. Um final day, we're um on his way now. We just um we just finished packing away. Um want to get out before uh, before the car, car park, park gets, gets full. Yes. Yeah. It's not a very good car park to be fair. No, we're it, right so. down in bottom right down in bottom corner and it does narrow down yeah. so there will be cars that will be both sides mm -hmm. and because of that yeah, <laughs> because of that, um obviously to it's, reverse out yeah, as well. Yeah, we yeah. we we're <clears throat> nosing from so so it's not, um, it's all right for small motor homes like ours, just yeah. six, six meters. Yeah, you won't want to be out bigger. bigger. And it is very slopey. We've just got like, right in end. Um, but you, yeah, it's, it's not brilliant. It's come and comfort day sort of thing, but it's, it's like okay say, for one night. Parking. It's not, yeah, food, but, um, food were brilliant. Just comfort restaurant. Yeah. 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 Food were brilliant. Couldn't fault that at all. Yeah. Um, and the staff. Staff. Yep. Yeah, really, really, really friendly. Landlady. Yeah. Any questions? And I mean, we right. we obviously asked a lot more questions than other people did about about the pub and stuff. Um, but it's yeah, a, yeah, as a as a as a pub stop, mm. Mm, maybe not. Uh, there is a caravan site just up the road, and apparently you do get a knock. From, we, were, we were lucky we didn't, didn't yeah, we? Unless we were, we were probably gone. out, yeah. um, but you do get a knock apparently in the sale, look, you do realise that there is, and you're on private property and you shouldn't be doing this, and apparently. So, you know, it's... You have permission from pub anyway. Yeah, so. yeah you're in their car park. <clears throat> um, yeah, we had a nice walk round last yesterday afternoon, nice wintry walk, um, as you've seen, hopefully. And then... Uh, yeah, time to go, really. Yeah, time. Um, other than that, anything? No, we've no. got something coming up in a, about a fortnight's time. Yep. Yeah, we're away again. Um, so if you want to see where we are. Yep, catch up on that one. Yeah. Um, we're going to try and get more vlogs out. We, we, we are pants at it. We just don't seem to get them out. Um, but we work full time, so it makes it hard. Yeah. <clears throat> so other than that, um yeah we're gonna get get on the road mm -hmm. um and um if you if you like what you've seen if you could um like and subscribe uh comment, comment. Mm -hmm. we um we do like the comments we always respond and um it's nice to it's nice to see what you guys are doing as well so yeah. let us know we did ask recommend, a few questions <laughs> recommend any more pub, pub stops yeah definitely yeah. um we're going to try and champion more in the yorkshire area um this year 
Uh, we do have a week away that won't be in in, um, in Yorkshire, uh, but apart from that, it's predominantly going to be Yorkshire. And um, yeah, we'll catch you on the next one. Okay. See you later. Bye for now. Bye.